Um, so yeah, last night we did pretty well. Uh, we activated three new lasers. Uh, the mountain is starting to look pretty bright up there. I think we've got six lasers. Yeah, you can see one, two, three, one, two, and then there's like, uh, you can just see the sixth heading over there to the, um, to that tree trunk, the treetop area that we did, sorry. Um, and now we're in this new area. So I haven't been through here at all. I've got no idea what's awaiting me. I've got sort of this peninsula and uh, jungle area. Um, there's also like a house over there towards the base of the mountain. Um, I might see what I can find uh, out here on this peninsula first. This is nice. I like this game. It is a pretty game. Can I go out into the... No, I can't go into the ocean at all. But, um... That's fine. <laughs> Who wants to be in the stinky old ocean? I must be walking past like a hundred um, environmental puzzles because honestly, this seems like the longest I've gone in this game without just running into uh, something. Yeah, it's just a Twitch notification telling me to do that dashboard on my phone. Doing it live, Twitch. Calm down. Here we go. This looks like a path. Ooh, there's like a... A monastery up there, I guess. Um, just gonna keep walking along. Ooh, that looks like a tower. That looks like something. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see what this does. Doesn't look like there'd be a laser here, but oh. All right then. I kind of thought that would. Uh, I kind of thought that would be something a bit more. I suppose. It seems very empty compared to the other side over there. We're tripping over puzzles all the time. Um, am I missing something? I must be. I don't know. I don't get it. There's the castle where we started. Um, all right, all right, all right, okay. Um, I guess I'll come up to this uh, monastery looking thing then. I've pretty much, um, I caught the boat from the town over to there and I'm pretty sure I'm closer to where I started. I might as well have just walked. Um, I don't know what this is. It looks nice though. It makes me want to have a tea party. Ooh. The stairs are quite steep, actually, looking at them. Oh, yeah, here we go. This is the stuff. Huh. Oh, there we go. Lovely. This is beautiful. Um... Okay, there's a couple of panels there that all sort of seem to connect up to each other. Um, there's this. It looks like... Yeah, so there's clearly something behind there that I'll get the opportunity to use. Um, I'm not sure what that's telling me. Uh, this is interesting. How am I going to do this? So I need to, I need to go around, but there's a tree in the way. All right. So what if I just block out one of the dots? No, that doesn't count. <laughs> Um, can I go into the middle there where the tree is growing? No, it doesn't look like it. Um, so like, it looks simple enough to just hit uh, both those dots, but it means I've got to go around the back of the tree and the game doesn't actually let you go around the back of things unless, no, I can't walk while I'm doing the lines, okay. Maybe I'll come back to that. I'll see what else I've got in here. Uh, not much, actually. Uh, 
Okay. Um, yeah, I was expecting a bit more, I'll be honest. Um, these cables don't seem to leave this area, so I don't, don't seem to be able to do anything with these. Unless that table is... Um, It must be related somehow, right? Is this the same model? Or is it... Like, is that just a little version of this big tree? It could be, to be honest. So then maybe... I can't access the corners like I was. Um... Maybe something else leads to here. What am I missing? Yeah, here we go, around the side. There must be more to see. This is a puzzle of ever I saw one. If I've got it lined up right, I have no doubt that that would be a uh, an environmental, but I kind of want the uh, I want the panels, you know. I want the I want the main stuff. I'm not really sure what to make of this. There's a gate over there. There's something in the middle of this. Oh, here we go. Is that a laser? Is that a laser box? That looks like a laser box. Okay, and that cable goes into the middle of that. Okay. What's what's through there? Mm -hmm. I might look at that shortly. I'll keep I'll keep to this area for now. This uh, is very similar to what was in the town, and I had to do that by looking through these um, the other door. I got that because the chat was helping me or I would never have done it. But actually, I suppose that this is where I was meant to learn about that. Okay. Um, can I see through the holes here? No, I can't. There are a couple of broken bits there, but... Oh, how frustrating. I'm, I'm quite certain that I could actually do these puzzles if I just knew where to start. So that won't open until I've done these. So it looks like this is the starting point. Um, so I guess I should get the perspective for the angle on this so that I can... Is there anything in the shadow? Not really. So before there was like, a, there was a gate to look through. Um, things kind of got in the way. But there's nothing really getting in the way of this. Unless I'm looking somewhere. Should I be looking through to something? That's quite frustrating. Um, that's just uh, Jeremy and Scott messaging me to figure out when we're going to stream together tomorrow. Uh, keep an eye out for that. Maybe I sort of avoid the green stuff. No. That's. Oh, hold on. That's interesting. The the shadow there looks like a person. See what I mean? Uh, I don't think that relates to the puzzle I'm trying to solve at all, but... Hmm. You know, maybe I will open this gate up, because I know I can do that. Uh, and then... Well, there's the town I was in before. There's the lake. I don't know if I've been over there to that area, that looks new and different. 
but I really want to do um, this area over here, this sort of um, jungle and everything. Maybe I'll come back to the monastery later. Um, if you guys want to see the monastery, we can come back here, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure what, I'm not sure where to start, which is really frustrating. Oh, hold on. This is, uh, this is something. Better than nothing. But like, duh. It's so frustrating when it's, it's not even like, oh, I've, this is too hard. I don't know how to solve this puzzle. It's like, I, I don't know what the puzzle is. I don't know where the puzzle is. I mean, obviously this is a puzzle, but uh, yeah, I'll concede that one is uh, too hard for me. <laughs> oh, well. Um, all right, so I guess we'll come down here then. Nope, there's nothing that way. There's nothing anyway. Where am I meant to be going? Let's go into this jungle a bit more. Oh, what are these? Are these like voice things? We join spokes together in a wheel, but it is the center hole that makes the wagon move. We shape clay into a pot, but it is the emptiness inside that holds whatever we want. We hammer wood for a house, but it is the inner space that makes it livable. We work with being, but non-being is what we use. Lao Tzu, 6th century BC. So um, that's talking about empty space. Um, I'm not really sure why. Ooh, nope, it didn't like that. Doesn't like that. But it does like that. Why? Who can say? If I go straight across, it doesn't like that either. Um, so what am I getting out of that? What if I try to just replicate that? Nope. Up and down. Yeah, I don't, I don't really know what I'm trying to do here, and it's frustrating. I mean, I guess what, what it's doing is it is getting me to go back and to redo this, to keep looking at, well, what's working here? Um, that's a great question, actually. I feel like that monologue about the empty space uh, is probably relevant somehow. Like, if I just go along the bottom, doesn't like that. If I go along the top, doesn't like that. What if I try to invert what I did before? It doesn't like that either. That's interesting. It's got to be top and bottom. Why? Oh! Ew. The bird chirps. Chirp, 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 chirp. Chirp, 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 chirp. The bird chirps. Oh, I'm really impressed with myself that I got that. Do, 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 do. Is that it? I think so. Oh, no. Let's listen more carefully. Do do dee do do. Do do 
Dee doo doo. Oh, this is going to drive me crazy. I'm going to go actually insane from this one. Where is it taking me around here? Nice tree there. Oh, what? That's a telephone sound as well. Is that relevant? There's something on there. Am I meant to be... Oh my... No, I'm just going to stick to the puzzles that I know I've got. I'm very lost right now. Okay. That telephone... I wish it would... Play the bird again. Play the bird again. Come on. Give me the bird noise. Oh, that telephone. Chip, chip. Play the bird again. <laughs> chip, chip. Boop, beep, boop. Is that it? The telephone seems to coincide with the two first chirps. Um, so I don't know. I don't know. <sighs> this is so hard. I wish it, I wish I could just play it when I want when I'm ready for it. My ear's not good enough for this. <laughs> chip chip bop chip bop. No, I'm sure that was it, surely. Chip chip bop chip bop. Chip chip bop chip. I thought that's what I already did. Chip, chip, bop, chip, bop. Yeah. What's this one then? Is this the phone? What? What is going on? Is this all just distracting me from the bird? Okay, yeah, let's just focus on the bird and see if we can figure that out and we can worry about the rest. Beep! Bop, bop. Yeah, there we go. It's just the bird. The rest of it, the telephone, the... Um. Beep, beep, bop. Oh, that sounded like more than four. It sounded like beep, beep, bop, bop, bop. Hold on. Yeah, it was beep, beep, bop, bop, bop. No. No, it was not beep, beep, bop, bop. Oh, I'm not sure. This is... I much preferred the, the more visual puzzles. I don't like this noise one. Chip, chip, bop, chip, bop. What, what does the long one mean? Chip, chip. Bop, chip, bop. Chip, chip. Bop, chip, bop. Bop, chip, bop, bop chip, bop. What? Dog, dee, dot. I swear that's it. Am I? I'm so sorry. My ear is not good enough for this. Oh, this is this is rubbish. Yeah. So there's five 
distinct bird chirps. Chip, chip, dup, chip, dup. <sighs> yes, I swear it's chip. Then it goes down. Then it wants to go back up there. But how do I... I can't get it to do that. I'm just sort of experimenting while I wait. Oh, wait. Do I have to go backwards, like... To fit them all in? Ship. Ship. Bop, that's wrong. So it's going high, high, low, middle, low, I'm sure, I'm quite certain. High, low, middle, high. Yeah, yeah, sorry. High, high, low, middle, low. Uh, it's how do I represent that on here that's now the problem. High, high. Low, middle, low, low. High, high, low, middle. So that's obviously wrong. Oh, there was a long one. There was a long one here as well. So what does, what's the long one? But there's still the right number of things here. The noise, the rest of the noise is just distractions, right? Yeah, that's, that's, that's just noise. That's not special or anything. Hold on. <laughs> Don't, I'm not, I'm not cheating. Don't worry. I'm just getting up my, uh, my Twitch touch my uh, Twitch dashboard on my phone. Um, just to give me a, a better idea of... Because um, it's quite difficult now, there's a lot going on, <laughs> to figure out what I'm listening to, which previously in this game hasn't really been a too much of a thing. But now all of a sudden, I am drowning in, in sounds. I've only got four... Bird. Is. I swear I've done every permutation of that. Is it not the bird song I should be listening to this time? Is it the wolf? What's the wolf doing? Play the wolf again, game. Yeah. Ooh. ooh, ooh. Okay. Ooh, like that? Ooh, ooh. <laughs> it's so hard to to grasp. Ooh. Okay, well was the wolf. It's just hard for me to hear it all. Okay, what have we got? What? I think I'll have to do the wolf again. Ooh. 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 Oh, shit. Is that it? Play it. Oh, 
I want to hear it again. Why is it taking so long between replaying it? No. No. Okay, what's the bird what's the bird chirp doing? Oh Ah, nope. Oh, I'm really stabbing in the dark with these ones. Play the play the sound again. <laughs> Make music to me. Come on. I've been going for half an hour. I've got nothing done. So the bird definitely sounds like that. But the whistle thing... Yeah, there we go. So I did actually get tested for being uh, tone deaf one time. Good news, I'm not. Uh, I'm just bad. And then where does that come out? Up here? Is this where I have to? No, this is taking me up the mountain. Maybe this way? This is lovely, don't get me wrong, but I want to get back to the puzzles I was just doing. That bamboo is hovering. <laughs> I don't know why I said that so critically. Um, Alright. I don't want to be here. I don't want to be going up the mountain just yet. A mountain is a, a scary place of scary things. God, the, all the noises. I don't like the noises. <laughs> it's too much. It's too much. I have to go up higher somehow, up here. Is this where I'm going? Oh, that looks good. Yep, yeah, this looks promising. This looks terrifying. Oh, it comes up from there and goes along the other way, I think. Gonna look through more of this bamboo forest. It's a beautiful location, but I feel like it doesn't bode well. Okay, so it keeps going along there, and then it goes up, and then it goes oh that way. down here. What is this? This looks dangerous. Uh, okay. So I guess I'm forced to explore. I can cross here, can't I? Yeah, okay. So I can cross here and go that way. But I don't think I want to. I think my puzzles are still on this side. Over here. This is so difficult to follow. I'm on rocks, I'm up I'm up here, I'm up the top. I've got a good view of that uh, monastery that I was in before, these sort of uh, lovely gardens. That looks like an environmental puzzle of some kind, at a glance.
Oh, that's a puzzle. That's... This one, uh, I assume that will also line up somehow with things. Um, this one would be a case of figuring out which is the correct... That looks pretty promising, actually. But not quite, that doesn't line up. Does that one line up in a way that I can get it to work? Actually, yes, it does. That looks promising. Oh, I've got to hit the dots! Oh, that just got much more difficult. Line up so that I hit the... Nope, not that one. Let's try this one. Uh, maybe if I... Go like there, there, there. That looks pretty good. Oh no, because I've got to go through there. You know what? Hold on, I will come back to that. I've got to try to stick to this. Um, So that's it. That's that's done, I guess. Cool, whatever. Nerd. I'll come over here and do my own fun puzzle for fun people. Uh, which is exactly what this looks like and definitely not uh, torture. What about this one here? If I get that... I mean, obviously it's just about getting it lined up right. It's just hard to know uh, how to get it lined up right. Will that work? No, it won't quite fit past those branches. All right. Um, let's try this one again. Nope. That doesn't look half bad, actually. Oh, can't quite get around that corner. Here we go, let's try again. Yeah, yeah, oh, come on. <laughs> and yes, 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 there we go. All right, let's do that then. We've got a way forward. I don't know if it's the way forward, but it's a way forward at least. Wow, this is horrifying. Um, mm, ambient sound effects are scary. Honestly, <laughs> I thought this was going to be taking me somewhere. That's a bunch of hexagons, which is great. You know, I love hexagons, but where I don't see hexagons anywhere. Like, if I find some, it's like great. Well, I've got a potential solution, but. I guess um I guess I can try to get in through here. Um 
maybe some of these might line up helpfully. No, they seem a bit too much. They're not intentional enough. I don't know where I should be looking for this one. That's too far back. I can't see the starting point. I swear I just heard a noise and that's kind of creepy. If I saw another person in this game, I would freak out so much. Uh, after all the solitude, <laughs> it, it wouldn't work out well for me. No, I don't think those bamboo leaves line up to do that. And this... Oh, I was going to say, the rocks make it so hard to see anything. But the rocks also, I think, might be giving me my solution. If I can just line them up right. What, really? Was that not it? It's meant to be that. There we go. All right. Well, I'm in. Um, maybe this was meant to be uh, the exit. Maybe I was meant to already have this done. Maybe that somehow provides answers for, um, for that one on the other side. This just seems like it would be so significant. This seems, and it's nothing to me. It means honestly nothing. Oh, have I not updated my, oh, cause I did the thing. I forgot to hit update information. Thank you for letting me know. There we go. Uh, that should be, that should be properly tagged now. <laughs> uh, cause I changed the things and didn't hit the update information button. <laughs> Thanks, Jeremy. Um, all right. Well, I guess I don't know. I feel kind of stuck. Then that seemed really, uh, really significant. That seemed really important. It just gave me a bunch of hexagons, and I don't have any hexagons to do anything with. Um, where does this take? Does this take me down to the? I guess I head back to the monastery now. If I can, because that thing still popped up in the path. It was playing more bird noises. Did you hear? That was the bird noise from the start, the cheap chirp. Uh, bird noise. I don't know what to do about that. Um, but there was um, there was a laser, wasn't there? Where was the laser that I saw before? Was it at the monastery? Let's head back there. I've opened it up from this side, thank goodness, so I don't have to go too far around. Uh, yeah, that's the laser that I was looking at. Okay. So where do I look to see this, to see the pattern on this one? Um, can I copy the pattern from before? Has opening that door given me an answer? No, I really didn't think that it would, but it was kind of all I had. This is all boarded up. I feel like if I could just get that open, then that would probably give me a lot of the answers I'm looking for right now. Unless that's an answer somehow. I don't think I'm at the right angle for this. Yeah. Bird noise is the true enemy of the witness. It's so true. It is so true. These bird noises are driving me insane. Alright, so I really can't see those things, but I don't know. 
I feel like there's just too many things happening simultaneously here. Let's go back into the jungle because there was more um, near the that big tree and the bird sounds. Yeah, here. Like there's something on top of that. So how do I get on there to do that? Here. All right. I thought that would um, do more, I'm not gonna lie. And this just takes me back down to the beach. <laughs> okay. Well, oh, hold on. There's something, there's something there. I'm not really sure what it is. I'm going to go back up to the thing that came up. Why is this looking very significant all of a sudden? Ah, uh, yeah, look here. The, it all goes on the other side of this. Oh. Okay. Cheap chirp. The auto has something to do with the sound. Cheap chirp. Is it volume? Oh my god. Chirp, chirp, cheap, chirp, chirp. Chirp, chirp, cheap. Chirp, chirp. Come on. Da da di da da. Da da di da da. Okay, okay. Hit me bird noise. Oh, come on. <laughs> hit me again, hit me again. Come on, come on, come on. Got nothing. No. <laughs> I hate these puzzles. Play it again, play it again. Do it again. <laughs> oh. Do do de, do do. That's all right. I'll oh, come off. It's so hard to tell which bird I'm listening to. to the end there. I'm going insane. Oh my god. Am I listening to the first one or the second one? 
Which one am I trying to interpret here? Oh my god! Do it again. Hold on, I've, I've lost even like what's high and what's low. High, low. So high is little, low is big. Yeah, okay, high is little, low is big. God, this. <laughs> this is so frustrating. Play the noise. Chirp, chirp, bob, chip, bop. I can't get both of those. Like, that... Oh, like that. Yes, I can. Never mind. Sorry, just slowly going insane. So this, this... This, 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 this. Oh! Chip, chip, dot, chip, dot. That was that one. What's this one? I hate this so much. This is torture. What was that? This is my own personal hell. Play it again. Do the... Chat, save me. Uh, I'm just gonna try a shape. Oh, now I've got to do this one again. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, it sounds low. Body. Like that. Oh my god, that was it. Now what? Is this this purple one? Is that what I'm following now? Where does it go? Hello? That's right, I haven't done anything in this bamboo yet. Man, this is eerie as all heck. Oh, here we go. Oh, that's it, that's the laser. That's the laser. Oh. <laughs> I am so relieved. That was it, that was, oh, that was the laser. It's just water in a pickle jar, but oh, oh, that's it. Fire it up, that's seven out of 11 lasers. Uh, we're doing pretty well. Um, I kind of want to die, but we're doing well. Let's crack this open now. Hey. I wonder what color this laser will be. Because they're all like uh, slightly different colors. Can't really see from here. But see, that one's sort of a bluey green. That one's a bit more pink. Oh, this one's blue. Uh, the colors will probably be relevant at some point. That seems like the sort of thing this game would do. Okay. Well, good. That's done with. I don't have to worry about those stupid bird songs anymore. Um, but that was the kind of puzzle that was in that uh, basement in the town. Where am I? 
I want to head back to the monastery if I can, which is back this way. Um, all right. So there was a door here as well, wasn't there? Oh no, so that door is opened by these. You know what? It's got to be that bonsai thing inside. There must be a way of doing this, I guess. Um, so what I need is... Yeah, there we go. I don't know why that didn't occur to me before. What's... Oh. So this is closing. And these are opening. This is what I needed. Yes, this is exactly what I needed. Here we go. It wasn't even done doing it. I knew exactly what I needed to get out of that. That's it. Oh, no. Didn't like that for some reason. Let's try again. Uh, so this one is here. There we go. Sounds like something else opened as well. Maybe I need to be adding some more things to this. So that doesn't look right. But this does. This looks very right, if I do say so myself. Um, like that? Nope. There's, um, it's this bit that's sort of confusing me. I wonder if I'm... I don't know. I guess I'll do this again. It's clever of the game to make you go back and it's like, no, what did you do? Like, how did you do it? But uh, it's frustrating as heck to, uh, to have to try again. It must be like that. No, why not? Oh, is it because this is snapped off or something? Is there... Is that meant to indicate the snap? Yeah, okay, it looks like maybe the snapped bits are meant to indicate. Where's the right angle again? Here we go. So let me show you what I mean. Uh, so I come over here, I line that up. Oh, it all looks good, except see where that is snapped. Presumably that means that there's meant to be something there but it's been snapped off. Yeah. Here we go. And this one's been boarded up. So I'm going to have to look at what the solution would be and flip it around. So it goes left, right, left. But it's backwards, so it's actually right, left, right. There we go. That was pretty easy, actually. Um, and then I'm back where I was before. There's this again, which takes me to my hexagon. The hexagons do look familiar, but I don't. I don't know where from. I don't know. I don't know what I meant to do with them. Ah, but there's stuff that's opened up in here. That's nice. What does it mean? What does that mean? Am I meant to look at that from somewhere else? Where else can I see that panel from? Nowhere here. No. Nothing here. Um, solving the bonsai plants did uh, open up things in different ways. So maybe if I solve the bonsai plant from here, will that open up that front side and give me like a new angle? Yeah, will this open? And then, yeah, look, there's a 
Oh no, that's that's what I used to do that other one. Um, oh, here we go. This plant has bits and bobs. Um, yeah. So these are all just perspective puzzles. Um, they're challenging, but they're not impossible. Uh, the hardest bit are those leaves that are in the way. But I think I'm just meant to be looking at the... I think I'm just trying to be looking at the... Um, the branches, but those leaves are awful, because presumably it's not just up and across. Yeah. How did I... Was that a problem for this one? How did I do it again? Oh no, the leaves were... The leaves were helpful. I just had to get it lined up right. What about this side? Yeah, there we go. That looks more like it. It's just finding the right angle. Once you figure out what the puzzle is that you're trying to solve, for the most part, it's fairly straightforward. But figuring out what you're trying to do is just the worst. Oh, I see. So this time it's telling me where to go. So two, two, one, one, two, one, one, two, three. I'm never going to remember that. Let's try it out. Three. Oh, I did remember that. First time as well. Uh, never expect me to be able to do that again. Um, okay, so that broken twig on the ground is probably meant to fill in the gap here, but I'm not sure where it's broken off from. Uh, you know what this calls for? It's time for another note-taking session. Uh, here we go. Uh, so I've got one, two, three by six. That's what I've got. I've got three squares across and six squares up and down. All right, the circle is here. Two down, three there, one there, and two, got one there, one there, one there. Two and down. Okay, that's the circle. And this shape is like two up, one across. Could go there, it could be backwardsy. I think so. So I think what it is, so I get that. Whoops that from the, the branches that are there and I think the twig on the ground is that and then the rest of the branches take me to there yeah, alright and then that goes outside uh, let's preemptively swap these around. They seem pretty uh, pretty banged up actually, the shutters on that side. I don't know if they're going to open properly. Oh no, they are, they are. Is it going straight there? Is the... Is it done? 
the shapes still seem very deliberate. I don't think I'm done. <laughs> I really don't think I'm done by a long shot. Um, oh no, this is it. This is another laser. Guys, we're killing it. That's eight lasers. Um, all right. What I will do while that's uh, loading up its lasers, I really thought they would be uh, more relevant, to be honest. Um, yeah, while that's all loading up its lasers, what I'm going to do is come back to here and I'm going to open up those other shutters on that side. I can't believe it took me so long to figure out this bonsai. But then as these come up, that'll give me uh, some more environmental puzzles. Quite a lot more environmental puzzle. Okay, I didn't think it would be quite that much, but that's fine. No, it's not happy with that for some reason. Oh, I see. I've got to get that yellow bit lined up on the gourd. Just right, just so. Well, that looks hard, never mind. <laughs> here we go, and back here. Is that the only one that's real and then the other's like red herrings or something? I don't quite seem to be able to get that to line up. Oh no, there we go. Okay, so this one will probably be real as well then. <laughs> uh, I don't know where I'm meant to take it though. Um, I must be missing something. Um, something else yellowed in front to fill in that gap. Uh, maybe I'm trying to put that in the wrong place. Maybe I'm looking at it from the wrong side. Let's run out quickly and see if I can see uh, any other way to look at that. This one here. Anything yellow? There's that laser. Oh. Laser number eight. Fantastic. Okay. Um. Yeah, I don't really see what... Oh, unless this one is meant to be going back the other way. I should be looking from this side. No, I don't think so either. Can I sneak through here though? No. <laughs> would have been nice. It would have been nice. Okay. So I really can't do anything other than that. I'm not sure how I'm meant to do that. Oh well. <laughs> My official stance is oh well. What I might do actually, I might head back to town and see if I can do that annoying bird chirp thing in the basement uh, that we went past yesterday. Um, where was it? In here. This was it. Oh 
song, but the room is the room is soundproof and the speaker is broken. What does this do? Where does it lead? Up there, whatever there is. Um, I was kind of hoping to do it, but I can't hear the bird sound and um, I'm doing quick maths in my head to figure out how many different uh, permutations of this there are to see if I could just brute force it. No, I don't think that's a good idea. I don't think that's a good idea at all. If I come out here, can I hear anything out of the silence room? No, I can't. Oh well. That's fine. Whatever. Is there some way into that orange shipping container? Not obviously. Here's the lake. All right. So uh, someone in the chat yesterday was telling me how the lights in the lake correspond to the lasers that I've uh, activated. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Where's my eighth light? I don't know, I'm sure it's there somewhere. Wait, is the lake? The lake is the shape of the island. Oh, that's beautiful. That's smart. I like that. So the the lights, I can see one light I haven't done over in that corner. One up there and one over there. I'm, I'm assuming that this does actually line up with the, uh, the map. So I guess that would be the mountain or something. Or the... It looks kind of like that would be the peninsula that I just did before, but I couldn't find anything over there. Let's head back over to the peninsula. We'll have another quick look. Or should I just wander somewhere I haven't wandered before? I don't think I've been to that castle before. I think I'd remember that. Let's head to the castle. The fort. The It's a bit spooky actually, isn't it? Yeah, there's definitely an unactivated laser there. Um, there's a couple of uh, doors around in the garden here. Alright, okay. Um, I guess let's go this way. This is nice. It's a maze. A little hedge maze. Yep. Uh, there we go. Oh, I think this is uh, the way that I had to go to get here. Is that not it? Let me double check what I had to do. So I came in, went to the left, all the way, nope, not all the way. Let me go around to the left, not all the way, wriggle around. There we go. That's nice, that's cute. Oh, and then that lets me exit easily without having to go all the way through again. That's nice. I do... Uh, the design of this game is just brilliant. Um, this one... Uh, seems simultaneously harder and easier. Given that there's so many different ways to do it. So what's... 
yeah, I guess without crossing the grass would probably be it. There's a sort of this worn path, so straight to the right. Right. All the way up, the little lefty bit at the end. Right. Right, all the way up, and a little lefty bit at the end. No. No, I did something wrong. Um, let's try again. What did I do wrong? So right, straight out the gate. Right, right. Oh, lefty bit at the end. So right, straight out the gate. Right, right. Another little lefty bit at the end. Oh, I must have just entered it wrong before. Um, these also seem to correspond with the four seasons. Anyone else picking up on that? It was like, uh, it was like uh, this looks like it might be autumn, I guess, or winter. This is spring. Um, the ground seems all pretty much the same. Um, Oh, let's go back to the start. So right away, I've got two ways I can go. Which way should I go? Do these flowers hold any clues? I don't know how they would. <laughs> oh, it's Gan it's Grandolf again. Hey, Grandolf, how are you going? It's great to see you again. Thanks for thanks for joining up. As you can see, we're doing a bit of witness. Uh, we're uh, going through some mazes. Oh, actually, maybe if I come up here and get a different angle on it. So obviously the maze itself is not that difficult, uh, but there's a certain way it has to be done that will fulfill that puzzle. Uh, yeah, so uh, I'll show you quickly uh, what we've been doing on uh, some of the other puzzles. Hold on. Just sort of seeing what else is around here. Oh, looks like a person. That's creepy. Uh, ooh. So yeah, uh, this is a puzzle game called The Witness. Uh, so for this one, let's look at this puzzle. So it's a maze, right? Uh, and you go through the maze, and then there was a door at the end, and you had to save the path. Uh, but the correct path is not necessarily just the way you walked. For this one, uh, there was grass on the ground. So uh, as I was walking through the maze, I had to not step on any grass. Uh, and that's the path that led me, here we go, to the door. So that's the path that I then entered onto the door here that sort of unlocked this door. Uh, so now I've got to do the same thing in this one. Uh, obviously in this one, the grounds are all gravel. So there's no grass to tell me what to do. Um, I'm not really sure what the difference between the paths is. So this is what I'm trying to figure out right now. Uh, and then once I get it, I put in whatever it is onto here. Obviously that wasn't right, nothing happened. Um, I might head back up onto that uh, balcony area and see if there are any... I'm not really sure what all this is. Uh, see if I can see any hints or clues from up here. Hmm. It looks pretty similar. It looks pretty much the same. Uh, I can see some of that hedge looks a little bit worn out, but that doesn't look that different from the rest of the hedge. So... What is different? What's new? Hmm. Don't really seem to be any clues down there. I'm pretty sure I've done that autumn area. Yeah, yeah, I think that's the laser. Yeah, that's the laser just there. So at the end of each area, you get a laser that pops out, and uh, all the lasers lead up to that mountain. So we're on 8 out of 11 lasers right now, which is pretty good. We're going pretty well. Where does that cable go? Over to that gate, of course. 
All right. Maybe, uh, I wonder if these exposed edges have anything to do with it. They're kind of poking out here. I don't think that they do, to be honest. No, there's too many of them. They're pretty much all poking out. Um, something about the hedges themselves? Is anything looking different about the hedges? Are there any hints in the shadows and these flowers? <laughs> I'm quite stumped, actually. Um, I really blazed through those other two. I got them pretty quickly. So this is uh, this is a bit frustrating now that I'm absolutely uncertain of what I'm looking at. If you've got any hints or any ideas, let me know. <laughs> but otherwise, uh, yeah, no ideas. Yeah, yeah, that's about where I'm at as well. Sorry, my dashboard on my phone isn't actually working. So I've got the chat up on the side on the screen so I can see what you're saying. But, uh, oh, man, so I can see what you're saying. <laughs> I wonder if it was something about shadows. Yeah, I had the same thought. Um, there are quite a few shadow puzzles in this game, so it doesn't, like, that sounds pretty reasonable. Maybe if I just try to sort of, um, I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. Um... Maybe, maybe it is just the way that I myself went for this one. Let's try it. I'll come out, I'll reset, and I'll just walk straight around the edges to the exit. I'll just follow that path. No, that was a bad idea. Maybe, um, maybe there's something in the shape of the hedges themselves. Are all of these hedges accurately represented here? Maybe that's what I need to be up there for. So there's a long one, uh, sort of an equals in that corner. I'm just sort of trying to look at it from like this sort of angle because that's the that's the thing that's on the gate. <laughs> Is there any audio difference? I actually just did an entire area that was just audio puzzles. It drove me crazy. Uh, there were like bird chirps and stuff that were different uh, pitch and different volumes and things. It was... Um, um, <laughs> but there's got to be something. All right, so those hedges do line up with, the, with what's on the door. Um... Are those shapes visible anywhere else? It does strike me as odd that there's this kind of balcony area up here. For what? Just no reason? I don't buy it. Um, I, I can't see what, what it offers me. Other than a slightly different perspective. Is it a perspective that do the hedges themselves block the way unless you go a certain way? Mm, doesn't really look like it. I wonder if I can actually activate that puzzle from here. Oh yeah, I can. Hey. Hmm. Let's get down in a moment. Hold on. Is there... Oh, I think there's actually sound coming from this chamber underneath. 
because I agree I can hear a slight slight audio difference. Hold on, I'm gonna turn that up. I think you might be onto something actually. Maybe there is a Sounds like it actually just goes like up and around. That doesn't work. Hold on, listen to those footsteps though. Yeah, I think I think you've cracked it. I think it is the footsteps in the gravel. So which is the right way to go? Do I want the fact that, that comes like loud and crunchy halfway? So it suspects that makes me think that's the wrong way. Nope. So what was that like? That? Was that it? Was it like that? Yes. Grand Elf coming through with the goods. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. There's just one more of these hedge mazes now. What have we got? Is this can't help but notice that there are a lot of like dead ends here in the real world, but there aren't on the map. Is this map it's like a Z shape kind of hedge here? And there isn't a Z shaped hedge on the map. So there's um Alright, so uh, this this map doesn't actually represent this maze perfectly. So what I might have to do is take careful note of uh, like one of the, the routes in this maze, I guess, would add up to that map. So I can see the map from here. Straight away I can say I can't go straight ahead. I can go to the right until I can't, about halfway. So about like whoops it's so slippery like to here um, then I guess I'm gonna go forwards as far as I can to the left uh, no no that doesn't seem to make sense so to the bottom to the right I can go all the way along and up and then all right I could do it from here Huh, huh. Oops, that was it, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Here we go, here we go. See, the audio puzzles I am terrible at. But the... Oh, shit, never mind. I was just bragging about how good I am at puzzles, but now this looks a lot harder, and I don't want to overcommit. <laughs> um, Alright, let's look around a bit. Let's just sort of get our bearings. Okay. Oh, there's a tower here. Oh, this tower will have... Yeah, that's the laser at the top. Okay, so this is where I want to end up at the end. Um, I can see that probably looks like the next place I want to be. Although I can come down here as well. That's a creepy looking statue. It's like a security guard with a sword. 
Actually, I quite like that. That opens that up. Alright, ooh. They're, uh, they're fighting. They've got, oh, they've got fencing masks on, and that one's like knocked the mask off the other one. The statues in this game are freaking weird. Um, I don't think I could get up this before. Maybe I could. It's a nice view. So there are the four, uh, the four mazes I've just done. And I guess these are other, this looks, oh, it's, it's a chess game, isn't it? Isn't it? From those statues? Um, okay, so I can only start like that. What does that do? Um, there's no starting point. That's kind of an issue. Uh, so clearly this is the, do I, oh, I've got to walk it. Okay. What is that? Yeah. All right. So, uh, with these, uh, with this one, you can see there's like a hexagon there, uh, to solve this puzzle, you've got to hit all the hexagons. So that's been a thing in some of the earlier ones and you've got to kind of learn the patterns. So I want to go forward up until I guess where that wall is go around, hit the hexagon, come up, around, uh, down, back around. Oh, that's a lot to remember, isn't it? Is there any, it doesn't look like there's any kind of into. Oh, okay. So it remembers where I've walked. That's good. And this must be a reset. Yeah. Cool. All right. So it was up here. and then right around. I really want to hug that uh, edge as much as I can. Um, I want to double check. <laughs> I want to double check what comes next. Okay, so then from there, I want to turn right. I want to come around here. So I really want to just sort of hug. I want to keep that edge on my left as much as I can, and then that'll solve the puzzle. Okay. So I come around here. Now I've got this edge on my left. I just keep it there. I just walk around. Whoops. Solved. That's quite fun, and the statues are, are quite enjoyable, really. I want to walk back on this in case then it like unsolves the puzzle. So that security guard again. There's a few people. Hi. Hey, guys. Ah, okay. This one looks a bit more complicated. Uh, so with the uh, white and black, like I've been calling them dots, but they're really more like rounded squares, uh, you've got to separate them um, so that they're in different areas. So this one... Uh, the solution will be from the starting point here to go up to the middle, then straight across to the end. Uh, so let's let's do that. Oh, shite. But there's a broken bit of glass. Oops. Oh, no. then how can I separate them? I'm not going to be able to. Uh, like I've got to get in there, so I'll have to go around, up. Hold on, let's reset, let's reset. Okay. I'm going to have to go up and around, so I'll make one area there with those uh, those white ones, come down, there, up, and all right.
I'm being very bold this time. I'm just going for it. Yeah. What's this? Looks like it's construction materials from whoever built this godforsaken island. Person is hauling stuff. I wonder if these were real people at some point. Um, and they've been turned to stone or... Oh, yuck, I hate these ones. Bollocks. Um, so the way that these puzzles work is that... <laughs> yeah, a little bit, hey. Um, the way these puzzles work is that uh, you've got to create areas that have those shapes inside them. Um, so for this one, a solution could be if we're starting here to come up and around, go down, that makes uh, that shape, um, then to come up and around there to the exit. That would be easy enough, but I suspect that there'll be other broken bits or things. Maybe if I go to the left and around, two up and then straight across. All right, let's try that. Yeah, because look, when I walk on it, it, uh, it activated that. So I've got to get the two in here and then go straight across. And then I want to get... Bastards. <laughs> Uh, hold on. Oh wait, I can walk here. Yeah. So I can't get across there to finish it off. Uh, but I have to. So how's that going to work? I guess I could try just walking on the other side. I think it's really going to not like that, to be honest. But, like, if I try to split the path. Like, oh, I shouldn't have walked across. No, I need to reset. I need to reset. Yeah, I've made a real mess of that. Um, okay. Okay. So that's blocked off. That's yuck. That makes that really difficult. But, oh well, let's try again. Two up, yep, and down. Up to here. Can't actually go that way. Along to here. Connect that up. Does it matter that I forked? Yeah, it doesn't seem to like it, does it? Oh, that's interesting. There's a lot of space underneath. I'm going to head back and see. So yeah, that would be an acceptable solution to that puzzle, except that we forked the, um, the path. So how do we, how do we do it without forking it? That's the question. Oh, I've just realised, no, I was just realised I've done the wrong shape down the bottom. Oh, I went too far there. Duh. Because that's only a, a three. Goes one, two, three. I uh, should have been going up here. And down. Alright, so let's try that same thing we just tried that I thought was stupid and wrong. Yeah, it still doesn't seem to like it, does it? But let's go back and double check our, uh, our answer again. Yeah, see so how it's one, two, three, then one up. So I've got one, two, three, and one up. This area is one, two, three, four, and up. Um, and it does have to have those shapes inside the areas, which is why not being able to go across there is just a huge problem. bottom shape isn't close. So open on that side is actually okay. Um, 
or at least in previous puzzles like this, it has been okay. Um, because it kind of counts the edge as closed. Because usually, um, like I can try it out. Um, I'll come over and, so I mean, nothing else is working at the moment, so I might as well give it a shot. Um, because usually in puzzles, you know, like, uh, like we were doing with the maze, you sort of have a start point as you move the mouse around, it follows you along. So you can't actually close off shapes. Um, it just sort of closes against the edge. Um, but I'm wondering if, um, with all these like wooden decking things, if there's a way that I can get back and do it normally, um, let's give it a, let's give it a shot, uh, without walking on extra bits. So I come up here, walk along, walk along. All right. Now let's see. Yeah, see, I've got some decking here. Yeah, that looks a bit better. Yeah, I'd like that. So see, when you do it, the cables light up, which is a really good way of sort of following like where you were to where you're going um, and to figure out what's meant to be next. I don't know what this is. It looks like it just is a convenient exit, yeah, out into this area that I've already done. Whatever, peace out. Uh, I'm coming back up to this cool area that I haven't done. Uh, so you can see this has similar blocks to last time. Uh, the fact that they're at an angle like that means that uh, you can rotate it and tilt that around. Um, yeah, it is a beautiful game. It's honestly probably one of the best looking games I've ever played. I really, uh, I really like it. I really recommend it. Um, so yeah, we can rotate these around, but the, uh, the, the shapes, like the blocks, whoops, the blocks still have to be in the shape, whatever shape we end up making. Um, also notice there are two, um, end points on this one. Oh, this could even be a, a mirror sort of one. So if I step here and walk across, yeah, see, it's walking across up there. All right. Uh, you know what? In some ways, that probably makes this easier. I'll just go up. I'll go across, up, and out. Let's, let's try that. So one, two, three. So on one hand, it looks like that has worked. On the other hand, I suspect that if I try to walk across here to get there, that it will undo all of my good work. So I'm just going to come back out here. It looks solved. It looks happy. Maybe that's what this is for. So I can sort of come out and around. But yeah, I love this whole area. It's really nice. I can't even remember what these puzzles were, to be honest. What did I... Oh, it was shadows. That's right. So the branches of the trees made uh, shadows. And I had to, like, avoid the shadows or follow the shadows according to the puzzle. And that activated that laser. And hopefully the puzzles we've just done will uh, activate the, the big laser that's in the tower in the middle. Here we go. So that big tower there has a big laser at the top. And I think it's ready to be activated now. If I come back through here. Yep, so that's the puzzle we just did. There's the thing. It's opened up this gate. Let's try this out. Let's see if the laser can be activated. Oh, shit. What the fuck? <laughs> what is this? It's all of it. It's all the... It's all the puzzles I've just done. So I've got to do that entire thing all together. Oh, heck, and there's another one for the route we had to take on those ones. Oh, bugger. <laughs> Ooh. 
looks like an environmental puzzle there. So there's a couple of um, these around. They're just sort of like little extra kind of things. Um, I don't really know what they do yet. Yeah, they're nice, they're fun. Um, <laughs> thanks, thanks Jeremy is feeling sorry for me. Uh, I appreciate your pity. Okay, let's start over here. These were the, these were the easy ones. Oh, but the starting point is here in the middle. So that's where I came from. I went up there. I can't even really see because of the, hold on if I, and then, oh, I can't actually see the puzzle and the mazes at the same time. Maybe if I'm like that. I came down there and went up and around. Okay, that's the first one done. And the second one I came up there, uh, had to follow avoiding the uh, the grass on the ground. Up here, this is where you came in, Grandalf. Uh, there were the noises, the noisy gravel. What was it like that, I think? And that last one we did so quickly I can't even remember oh that's right some of it wasn't real um, and it was that uh, oh. all right nice that's one that's one half done oh yeah that's the laser but presumably it won't activate until I do the other side as well or will it? Could I be really lucky right now? I tell you what, if I don't have to do that, I am not going to do it because that was heck. Um. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Actually, it's quite threatening from that angle. Yeah, look, it's turning over, it's pointing over. Please turn on. It's. That's it, it's on. That's three lasers we've done uh, in the last um, hour 40. That's really good. Um, I think there's only two lasers left on the island. Um, oh, that's, that's where we did the treetop stuff the other day. That's the swamp, I hate that place. I can see there's another laser box down there, so I guess that's probably where I'll head next. Um, and then there's just the mountain and the challenge is there to go. Um, I wonder if I should still do this. I really don't want to. I don't even see how I could, to be honest, because how do I, how do I do that bit at the end? If I get it wrong, will that disappear? I don't want to have to do that again. Uh, I'll give it a shot. I'll give it a shot at least. Alright. I'll stop whining about uh, playing video games and about how hard that is. And... Actually, truth be told, this looks... This looks like it might just be solving its own thing. I don't think I can actually... Um, yeah, I can't just follow the route that I took to do this, I don't think, because there's not room. Um, Hold on. So, blimey, that's bothersome. So really, um, 
that's got to be its own thing and then come back up to do that. But it can't do it. There. Uh, yeah, that's... I'm just going to walk away from that. I'm going to run away from that. If I need to come back and do it, then we can come back and do it. But it's really scary. I'm just going to run right out of here. Nope, not that way. The other way would be better. How do I get down there again? Oh no, I'm so stuck. Let me out, security guard. I am just running straight out of this castle. <laughs> All right. So there was that uh, laser sort of in the, I don't know what you'd call it, uh, that area over there at the base of the, the mountain. Um, I guess that's where I'll head now. I think this is the wrong side. Or is it? I thought... I'm quite certain I've already done all of this. I was sure I'd already done all this. This is... I know how these sort of puzzles work. I don't know what's going on right now. I am sure I've already done this. But that laser's not on. I guess this is the right area for it. Oh well. Uh, it makes it easier on me, I guess, to just do puzzles that are easy, so... Um, I'll just keep going. Yeah, then this um this changes these bridges. Like I I swear I remember this. Like that um like, I, I solve this puzzle and then that bridge comes out, it like spins or whatever. Um, I can't remember how the puzzle solves exactly, but you know. Um, I'm not actually sure how to, how to get that one in here because uh, I can't really like do that. Um, I can't actually get an area for that one, but I can sort of make other areas for them, um, so that gets those two, but not that one in the middle. I did do all these, didn't I? Yeah. So why is that not going? Like, that, sorry, the cable is what I'm looking at. Um, all right, <clears throat> let's refocus, let's refocus. I'm sure this can be done. There's no question in my mind um, that I've not been given an impossible puzzle. Um, it's just... How do I get that in oh that's right it's exactly what I said before it doesn't go in the middle it goes on the edge and then that moves this bridge across see I remembered that solving the puzzle um, would move the bridge I remember that um, and again I haven't actually played this game for five years so the fact that I remember it tells me that I'm remembering correctly Sorry, I saw an environmental puzzle there, like when those two things connected and it made a nice little thing. Anyway, let's keep going. I know I've done these blocks. I know how the blocks work. I don't know why this isn't done. Is that... Is that laser there? 
that one. Is that the one from the castle we just did? And that's the treetops. Maybe I never finished this area. Maybe I didn't save. Because, yeah, these are flooded. Then they drain of water. I'm sure I remember this. This is weird. It's wigging me out a bit. Um, interestingly, though, this is also uh, definitely the area um, that made me uh, stop playing The Witness five years ago. <laughs> I remember that very clearly. Uh, favourite game of all time? That's a pretty hard one, actually. Um, but I would have to say uh, the Mass Effect trilogy. Uh, it's I just love it. I love the story. I love the characters. Um, I just love the world that uh, that game creates. Um, the world building, the different uh, species and races and everything. I just love it. I think it's great. Um, this is not right. There we go. Hey, nope. Like that. Sorry. Did you try Andromeda? I did. I actually quite enjoy, enjoyed Andromeda. It didn't um, it didn't capture the magic for me, and it felt kind of grindy. Like I thought the the sandbox areas were a bit too big, a bit too open. Um, like I really missed the the focused missions. Um, and sense of purpose, I guess, from the first Mass Effect games. Um, but I, I did quite enjoy Andromeda. I think um, I didn't think that all the the negative feedback it got was entirely justified. Um, I can understand that people were disappointed by it, that it wasn't what they wanted after such a long break. But personally, I was pretty happy with it. I liked it. The, um, the companion PB, I really thought I would not like, like specifically dislike. But um, no, she ended up being one of my favourites as well. So that's always a pleasant surprise. I think if I got that kind of shape, obviously I couldn't do it that way because I'm not finishing at the exit. Um, would that get me everything I need? One, two, three, four, one, two... Yeah, and then no, nah, no, nah, that would not work. Um, let's try a different strategy. If that was just three. That went on there, that went on there. Like that. That looks better. I think that's what I want. So I want to carve out that bit and that bit. Is that right? No, it doesn't like any of that. <laughs> Hold on. I thought that I had that right. Let me. There we go, let me try that. I see what I've done wrong. That doesn't actually join up. Doesn't it? No, no it doesn't. Hmm. So I was sort of thinking I was just going like three across, uh, then three up. Yep. Um, that other one, because they're so spread out, that's what makes it difficult. Um, so maybe I've got to really... Um, I guess abandon that idea of doing it quite so rigidly. Maybe if that... I put that there. Those three go up. No, that doesn't work. Um, but 
that fits there and that gets those ones. I've sort of made two shapes. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I'm feeling pretty nervous about this actually because I didn't really enjoy um, this area before and now I've got to do it again. That is my own personal hell. Uh, this looks like it's a quick exit. I might just do that. Um, and that way here and then here. That's the shape I want. How do I end at the exit with that though? That is the question. Um, unless I just rearrange things a bit. Like, no, I can't do that because that's cutting out the, uh, the other one. Uh, and I can't do it that way either because then it cuts out the other two. Seems to be getting through it pretty quickly. Thank you. Thank you for your support. Uh, <laughs> it's, um, yeah, I don't know. It's I, I think it's more that I've got like a really negative uh, association with this level, whereas the puzzles themselves are fine. In fact, they're actually like they're good puzzles. It's a it's a good um, I guess mechanism for a puzzle. I'm I'm just traumatized <laughs> from last time I tried this level. Um, that should work though. There we go. So where does this go just down to the water here I guess actually I think that this takes me around to the boat and last time I got here I think I did arrive by boat yeah this is where the boat is so I rocked up through here I was doing things maybe a little bit backwards that's cute if you stay in the right place they're like holding hands that's actually kind of beautiful and terrifying from the wrong angle. Um, yeah, I don't want to jump ahead though. I don't want to be where I'm not meant to be. Oh, that's just started moving. I'm just going to move right away from it. Were you going through something last time? I don't think so. I think I just, uh, like the, oh, actually, no, I didn't, I don't think I ended up um, uploading the footage. So five years ago, uh, we had uh, this Virtual Jams channel. We were doing things on YouTube. Um, it was sort of before Twitch was a big thing. It was probably, Twitch was probably a thing, but just not as big of a thing. Um, and I was recording Witness for that. So um, the early, the early parts of the Witness are up on that YouTube channel still. Um, I don't think I ever... I uh, ended up uploading the last few bits, but oh, it just, this part, there were bits that I just couldn't figure out. I just got really angry at it. Um, and then, cause I didn't play the game for five years. That's what sort of stuck, I guess. Those were the, um, that's what stuck with me. Um, that's not gonna work. Yeah, and it's not really, it's not the game's fault, of course. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's just sort of uh, what made me come back to it. I guess um, now that we've started streaming again, um, I was sort of uh, just thinking, you know, like what kind of games did I want to play? And the rest of The Witness was something I really did enjoy. Um, it was something I always wanted to play, but I was like, oh no, I don't want to play it in case I, I do end up um, streaming again. Like, I, I want to finish it as I started it, which was um, like doing a playthrough and, and sort of sharing that. I don't know. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, so once we started streaming again, I figured, hey, well, I'll pick up The Witness again. And so far, we're doing pretty well, I think. Personally, I'm pretty happy with how it's how it's going so far. Um, this bit looks a little bit confusing, but that's okay. 
uh, getting that top corner. It's three down, actually. You know, that's that looks good. That looks good. Up, down. No, I want those three. And like that. No, no, I didn't like that. Oh, oh no, no, I thought that would work. So, oh, because that, that corner, I had to get rid of that corner. So what I'm, um, oh, it's so hard to, like that. Yeah, there we go. So I sort of put that bit goes across there. Those two are there and there. And that one comes down the bottom there. Sorry, I should have explained that better as I was doing it. Uh, so here we're learning about the rotating one. So this is all what I was talking about before. Like I, I understand the uh, basic, I guess, concept of these puzzles. Like I, whoops. Um, oh, I rotated that the wrong way. That's why it doesn't like it. Um, so I could do one there. Can't do another one right next to it. Um, that is a little bit tricky, actually. Um, hmm. Let's see. I'm not really sure what to to do with these. And the color doesn't make it easy to look at either, does it? Um, let's see. So I can't put one there because of that. Um, I mean, I do have to take up both of these pieces. So having that as a general starting point, seems sensible. And then the next bit can be kind of like that. All right, so now I just have to do that the other way. There we go, there we go. Um, like that, all right, easy enough. This is where I just was. I'm just going to keep following the, the cable that's lit up. And that's going to make it easier for me to know where I'm up to. Uh, okay. So straight away, I'm, uh, my initial thoughts are sort of carve that bit off for um, to get that. If I then include sort of that, um, and that gets that bottom one as well. Um, and then sort of, well, but I can't get that on its own, so that doesn't work. Unless I get, so that is sort of those top two blocks with that uh, L-shaped one put around the bottom. Um, then if I went like that, that would be great except that obviously um, actually there's a lot that's wrong with that the more I look at it the more I see that is wrong <laughs> um, so specifically that obviously I can't go up there uh, and also that I've actually excluded that uh, bottom L-shaped block let's try that again let's find a new way to do that a new, more, better way. Hmm. I guess that bit could kind of go like that across. And then so that kind of went there and there and Oh no, I can't have that there though. Hold on. 
Let's see, what do I need? Um, maybe that's... So that bottom L could go there. Get that. And then... Then if I put that long bit... I can't put it anywhere that actually gets that L block inside because all the corners are blocked off with that uh, other bit. This area. This area. <laughs> ah. Okay. Maybe it is just... Uh, If I do that, I have two, yeah, there we go. All right, so I'm finding two areas. I imagine that it's sort of going to be wanting me to do that with all of them. I imagine that that's what this is trying to teach me is that um, I have to make more than one area that all the shapes fit in. I've got to do two areas. Okay, well, that's peachy. That's fine, we can do that, that's easy. We've got the brains trust here. Um, that gets those two. And then this one is, what is that, four high? So like that. There we go. All right. Here we go. We're learning. We're doing good learning. Um, So I can separate that one pretty easily, uh, but I can't actually. No, I could do that sort of thing and come down. Then I can't actually separate that one on its own. So I think what would be easiest is if I put those two together, and then dealt with that other one. Maybe this is one that would be easier doing them all to What have I done? Something goofy. Does that get all of them? No, it doesn't. What am I looking at? Oh, because that's six. That's I thought that was four stacked together. No, that's a six. Uh, all right, that uh, makes things harder, but it's still achievable. That, yeah, actually, it made things much easier. Oh. <laughs> Look at this, though. Look at this. Look at this. Um, all right, so straight away I'm thinking those two obviously can combine into a like two by three, like six block block. Um, and that sounds good. I like a, I like the sound of a six block block. Um, the, the other one can sort of like go underneath that. So like you'd have like a, like that sort of shape. Uh, except that obviously the other block then isn't like the the one on the right isn't included in that and also the uh, the single one up the top um, I mean we can solve that easily enough so like that sort of shape would include everything um, but obviously it's not reaching across to actually get those other blocks that we need so then how do we do that I'll tell you how Maths, probably. Um, do I want to try to get all of this in one big area? Or will it be easier to separate this out? That's, that's sort of the question that I'm grappling with right now. 
Um, I could do that. I think that does it. Yeah. Hey. All right, here we go. We're on to laser number four for the night. We're going to do it. We're going to get this done. All right. Oh, it's the underground bit. Oh, I don't like the underground bit. Oh, that's right. Uh, so that is a subtraction, the empty one. We did uh, we did a bunch of these yesterday. That's, uh, that's sort of an awkward one, actually. There we go. Gross. That's mold. <laughs> you don't want to be down there. Let's get out of. Let's get out of here. All right. Uh, we'll turn this bad boy around. Uh, so we want to hit the purple one. Hey. Oops. What am I doing? Like that. No, it still wants me to go through and do all the other shapes as well. All right, here we go. I don't think I've actually started in the right place to... Yes, yeah, so that's what I want, but to do it well. <laughs> um, Oh no, yeah, look, so I want it to go from like blue to purple. I'm just sort of looking for hints from the environment there on how to do it nicely. Like that's what I want, but I've got to get these ones first. So, bleh, bleh, back to where I started before. That took longer than I needed to. <laughs> that red one is all busted to hell. That black one is where we came from before. Oh, I can hear frogs. Lovely. <laughs> All right. Let's go. Turn us around. Turn us around. Here we go. Here we go. We're ready. We're raring. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's 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 make the magic happen. Here we go. So there's another undergroundy bit. I assume doing that undergroundy bit will make uh, a pathway magically appear. <sighs> These undergroundy bits, this is where I got. This is what turned me off this game five years ago. Oh, it's one of those sound things. Let's have a listen. A poet once said the whole universe is in a glass of wine. We will probably never know in what sense he meant that for. Poets do not write to be understood, but it is true that if we look at a glass of wine closely enough, we see the entire universe. There are the things of physics, the twisting liquid which evaporates depending on the wind and weather, the reflections in the glass, and our imagination adds the atoms. The glass is a distillation of the Earth's rocks, and in its composition, we see the secrets of the universe's age and the evolution of stars. What strange array of chemicals are in the wine? How did they come to be? There are the ferments, the enzymes, the substrates, and the products. There in wine is found the great generalization. All life is fermented. Nobody can discover the history of wine without discovering Louis Pasteur, the cause of much disease. How vivid is the glass, pressing its existence into the consciousness that watches it. If our small minds, for some convenience, divide this glass of wine, this universe, into parts, physics, biology, geology, astronomy, psychology, and so on, remember that nature does not matter. Let us put it all back together, not forgetting ultimately what it is for. Let it give us one more final pleasure. Drink it. 
and forget it all. Richard Feynman, 1963. All right, well, thank you for that wonderful monologue, uh, voiceover. That was great. Uh, as you may have noticed, I had a great idea that instead of trying to work these around in my head, which takes forever and frankly is not very flattering to me, uh, I'm going to get out some bits of Lego <laughs> and try that instead. So um, it occurs to me this is all going to be backwards for you guys. So for that, I am truly sorry. Uh, but I think this is achievable. I think this is a good way of doing it, actually. So this, what I've built here, uh, comprises this area. Um, so far, I'm pretty happy with that. We could add sort of that on there. that on the end Oops. and this bit goes on top now it's sort of hard for me if I build all this together it's sort of hard to tell um, like which bit is which but that's okay I only need to know that um, like that isn't included that's not included that's not it. Oh, shite. I missed that bit. Or like it's included in my model, but it's not uh, included in the shape. All right. Let's try again. This seems like a great idea right up until the execution. Yeah. <laughs> my view account just halved. <laughs> the payoff for that anticipation was not worth it. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> all right, all right, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, all right. Whew. Um, if I just move that bit over, actually, if I move that bit over one, then I think the rest of that still works. Uh, that bit goes down there. This is the bit that I got stuck on before. So that goes all the way there. And if that goes on top, da, 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 yeah, then that should work. And that goes there. So we get, <laughs> thanks Capuro. Uh, it occurred to me during that uh, monologue that, no, I've got the same thing again. See, I've got this one, two, three. I'll flip it around so you guys are looking the same, uh, the same thing. The problem I'm having is this dropping down of three here, then cuts out my thing. Um, but if I could have that, I guess just like up one, but then there isn't room for that, that long bit. Hmm. I think I just need to swap the way I'm thinking of these two. So hold on. If I you make all the shapes of the bricks yeah just before um, oof. it's this this little fella because if he goes there that is not included so where else could I put him let's try moving him up a bit and then I'll put the the two by two square on the side there that fella goes there this guy goes here 
and the only things that we need to cut out are those two top corners. Let's see if that works. Hey! Now we're cooking with gas. I don't know what that did actually. The more I look at it, the less uh, effect it seems to have had. Um, I can tell there are environmental puzzles to be done here. A lot of fun to be had, but I'm just going to keep on moving with the uh, the main things. So that did nothing there, which is what I was, ex I was sort of expecting something to happen. Um, light anything up is there a cable coming out of it no all right okay um, well let's go back this way and see um, let's head over there and see what I see what we can see that bit off and like that. Oh doy. Oh. It would help if I actually looked at the pieces that I was dealing with instead of just making uh, assumptions based on what I wanted. <laughs> All right, I'm going to deconstruct my uh, my Lego thing. It's really convenient that I said a giant tub of Lego here. That's for work, so. Thanks, work. <laughs> Let's try again. So this looks like this will connect to that uh, bit that we just did. <clears throat> uh, and also give us a little path going up there, which is I think it's over there. The light. Oh, there's the laser over there. So we're not too far. Can we get across yet? Oh, we're so close. Come on, there we go. All right, yeah. So we've joined up here, and then we can come up here. God, this game is beautiful, isn't it? I love it. Is there a backstory to this game? I don't think so. I think it's literally you wake up one day on this island. Um, I did have uh, someone in chat yesterday telling me that once you finish the game, there's like a, it sort of explains like the point to it, like the philosophy of it. Um, but I have not ever gotten that far. So I do not exactly know, but given that the game sort of forces you to slow down a lot of the time, take in what's really quite a small, densely packed area, um, that it's called The Witness. <laughs> I sort of assume that it's like the, the idea of the game is to force you to slow down and appreciate the details rather than just like running through things. Um, this is quite cute actually. I like this. I don't remember this. <clears throat> yeah, the audio logs are all uh, quotes from throughout history. Um, so that one I wasn't really paying attention to it, to be honest. I got distracted by Lego. <laughs> um, okay, so this is just joining back up to where I was before. Where's... There's that laser. That's where I want to get to. Um, yeah, but one of them... Yeah, they, they just sort of talk about physics. They sort of talk about philosophy. Um, again, I think it sort of fits that theme of just like slowing down and contemplating like simple things in life. <laughs> yeah, they're getting high. <laughs> they are a bit rather. Oh, there's a laser box, but I want the one that's over here. I don't know if I'm going the right way. I feel like I'm getting way too high. As in like high up the mountain, to be clear. <laughs> Where is that friggin' tree? How do I... That's it there. Yeah, I'm in completely the wrong area right now. This is not where I want to be. Uh, <laughs> oh, um, 
<laughs> Skip the row. Yeah, let's head back down there. Let's, let's, ooh, that was terrifying for a moment. You can't actually fall, you can't jump. Um, it is a low action game, that's for sure. Uh, no, I'm not going to look at that laser box until I get this other one. We can easily get this laser box. We're so close to it now. Where am I? Oh, hold on, I've got to, I've got to do it. It's like Simba. <laughs> That's the wrong part of the movie. Whatever. <laughs> Don't you judge me. I'm on the internet. <laughs> Oh, okay. I don't... Being here actually does nothing for me. Hey, yep. Hey. Actually, why don't I just go out that other... The other way would have been much faster. Oh, well. Uh, well, we've got time while uh, this slowly turns around. I'm going to put these, uh, I'm going to put this giant box of Lego back down now, since I'm not using it right now. And we can always get out the Lego again if, uh, if we need it for another puzzle. That works pretty well. I, I think, um, <laughs> I think it worked better than, uh, me trying to do that in my head. That, that was never going to work. It's like 11 o'clock at night here. My head barely works at the best of times, although saying that, like eight lasers already. Uh, we're doing pretty well. Let's see how many puzzles we solved. Yeah, so we've got uh, eight lasers. We've done. Um, you know what? I'm not going to try to tell you which uh, which ones I've done and which ones I haven't done because it is. Um, so I started this game five years ago. Uh, did I think about four lasers and then stopped. And now I've picked it up and I'm trying to like keep going. Uh, from where I was, uh, which in a lot of ways is a terrible idea. I swear I just heard a, a loud sudden noise. It reminded me of the pistol in Fortnite. Um, there was another like underground area over there. I think that might be where I need to go now. So let's go blue to black. <laughs> Oh, I thought it would turn quickly to get me there, but no. Instead, it's going the long way around and ruining my dreams. That looks like it would be part of an environmental puzzle. Oh, if you go into the menu and load game, it shows you how many. Holy! That's a lot! 333 puzzles solved! Oh, there we go. It was four years ago. Um, but most of the puzzles I've solved has have been uh, like the last two nights or whatever it's been. Wow. I am very glad you uh, you showed me how to do that uh, because I did not, I uh, didn't realize that was a thing. And I feel, uh, I feel pretty chuffed right now knowing I've done 333 of these bad boys. Um, Okay, yeah, so this is where I was thinking I would go, but that cable is still not lit up. So let's follow it back and see if, ah, uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, over here. All right. So we want to subtract one. I'll just take it off the corner there. Is that not? No, because I can't do maths. Like that. There we go. All right. Um, like, hold on. Like that. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Here we go. We're doing pretty, pretty well. Pretty well. Uh, so. That's the shape I want. I just want to do it so that it finishes in the right place. Uh, so how do I do that? 
Wait, why am I do why what am I doing? That's not right. That's that is wrong. Uh you want that. That's what I want. Okay. So like oops. That. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Alright. Baby da ba boo da ba. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Um, interesting big uh, clump of things being deleted, being uh, removed there. Hmm. <laughs> so let's figure out firstly how this would all fit together. I'm thinking that's an obvious one. Uh, then sort of like that gets uh, that shape one or that shape one if from your angle. Um, but then that other one, hold on, if, oh wait, no, because that ends there, huh, this is quite tricky actually, we've, uh, we've stumbled on a difficult one. I'm just going to take a shot in the dark just in case that worked. <laughs> if I could just like cheat a little bit. Uh, I was all for it, but alas, no, that's not to be. Um, let's give up on that coming up there because that's a dead square. That does nothing for me. That is that. That is those two on the left. Um, Again, I'm just going to take a shot in the dark. No. I should probably sit down and actually figure this out. All right, all right. Um, that's just a rubbish big block of uh, things to delete when I don't really have all that many ways, I guess. Yeah, it's just sort of hard figuring out um, like how do I get this stuff in the corner? Like that. And then, but it's not rotating. They're not at the angle. So they're not ones that I can rotate. Um, it's, <sighs> I'm so sorry. So what I've got, that is that one there. That's, no, it's not, it's this one here. Oh boy, that's not a good sign. That's not a, <laughs> uh, that's not good. All right. And then I can put that on top, that's that one. Then what I'm missing is that one in the far left corner. So let's say I bzzzed out those four using my removey, then I add that one on top, I'd get that. Except that obviously then uh, two of those shapes aren't actually included in that. So that doesn't work and it's, and it's dumb, frankly. Um, though it does raise the, the excellent point that whatever I end up with is going to have to include all of these and maybe that's how I should be looking at it. Um, no, that's not going to work. Okay. That. That. No, okay. How do I... If I went like that and that and that, that's those two, um, like the two flat pieces, I guess, stacked on top of each other. I can't. 
All right, that's not a useful way to stretch. I want to stretch this shape so it hits all of those different blocks. That's the bit that I'm getting stuck on. That's the bit I'm having uh, a problem with now. Um, so, like, that, of course, is the easiest, most obvious way to get all of them. Um, but that's not going to... Oh, it does work. I don't know how that actually solves, and frankly, at this point, uh, I don't know if I care. <laughs> screw that puzzle, screw this area, get me back to the fun ones. Um, all right, so looking at this, I've got two needy minuses. Um, and uh, yeah, so what I'm thinking is I'm just going to draw the shape that I'm thinking. If I do this, then I've got um, that sort of T block I've put into the middle, and then I've used the negative E minus E things firstly to make space in the middle to put that T block and to get rid of that gross bit in the corner. So I'm just going to do that same thing again. Yep, there we go. That's what I needed. That's what I needed. So if I just keep talking nonsense for long enough, eventually I stumble onto something worth saying. And then now this has drained. God, this is grim, isn't it? It looks like I'm in a room full of blood. Heck. Um, all right, sure. It's kind of weird. This is a weird room. Um, uh, I feel like that's an easy way to do that. If I leave some of those uh, minus C ones out, are they going to be upset? <laughs> Like, are, are their feelings going to be hurt or whatever? I feel like probably. I feel like they'll flash and beep and complain. Ugh. So, what can I do about that? That's an easy, obvious one to take care of those two. Um... If I could just sort of... But then... What do I do with the rest of that? If I just kind of go yuck and yuck, I thought maybe... Yeah, okay, so that one in the area on its own isn't happy. It wants to delete something. What if I just coordinate off. No, it really wants to be a part of what's going on here. <sighs> okay. It's such a little drama piece. Uh, but I mean, one of these, at least, I'm going to have to take out on its own, uh, simply because I've got to come up through here, either separate like that or separate like that. Um, so maybe if I do that, then they all kick each other out. All right. Oh, that looks scary. Why would you ever walk down here? Like the rest of the game is so pretty and peaceful. And then this is just like blood city. I mean, obviously, it's not actually meant to be blood. It's meant to be these petals or whatever in the water, but still, it looks grim. Okay, where's a puzzle to solve? Oh, it's down there. This is going to be going up and down or something, isn't it? That's what I'm looking at here. Um, let's just take two out. And whoop. Yeah. All right, so I want to get over there. So it's those 
to uh, want to be the one, so I get rid of. Oh, but that's. Uh, so I want to get those two is what I want. Yeah, but I just have to be able to be. Uh, I'll do the wrong two again, but that'll bring these ones up. And then can I get to C? No, I can't. That's trash. Um, I'm just going to have to do it and run for it, but it happens pretty quickly. That doesn't seem right. This is, in general terms, not a game about speed. And that bar is in the way. I'll just have to try it and see what happens. Oh no, see, it, it actually sort of froze me in place. Although, actually, maybe this is more like a maze. So if I cut these two corners out, here we go. This looks more like it. I cut these two out. And then I cut I don't know if uh, you just realize the same thing I did, but if I cut out those last two, then I'll be then this will go up. But if I cut out sort of these two, then that one's gonna go up in front of me. And I think it's gonna stop me from being able to yeah, do the puzzle. Oh, but there's another one here. That's really convenient. Hey, yeah. And we're out. We're done. This is it. Boom. Laser. Hey, yeah. Oh. That level murdered me last time. It literally, I was like, I just remember being so angry at it. And this time it's been a breeze. Uh, you know, it's been fun. That We've had good company, uh, great banter in the chat. This has been pretty good. Um, this is how everything should happen. Thanks, Kapuro. You're great. <laughs> yeah, coming of age. <laughs> oh, all right. I tell you what, um, there was that, ooh, looks like a spooky cave up there. That's kind of nauseating. Um, there was that uh, laser back towards, is this, oh, here we go, this looks easier. Let's go this way. Uh, yep, there we go. Oh, come on, why? Uh, just let me go through the door. <laughs> just let me walk through the door like a normal person. Um, there we go. So back up this way, uh, there was a, a yellow box, like a laser box on top of the hill. Uh, that's what I'm going to go back for, because I think I've only got two more laser boxes left. So we're doing really well, actually. Um, yeah, here we go. So here's another laser box. Um, and I believe that I get to it, yeah, at the bottom of this hill. So this is that jungle that I was in before, where all the bird sounds were. Uh, screw those bird sounds. They were awful. <laughs> um, and then, here we go. Just got to keep those separated. Oh. This is pretty. So looking through the... Because like, that looks like it's like a blue and red flower, but looking through here, they're both blue. So obviously looking through this is going to change um, how things look and react. And that's going to be... I guess the point of this. Uh, yep. Yeah. 
so far, so good. Uh, that's a bit challenging, because how do I finish over there? That is a bit challenging, actually. That. There we go. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to do that. There we go. We are crushing this. Yep. Yep. Guys. Whoa. Uh, yep. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, oh, that's a bit harder. That's a bit harder. That's okay. The difficulty I'm having. Okay, hold on. We were just like bam, bam, bam. Um, except now, I can't do that because I've got to separate there. I can't do that because then the yellow and red are together. So. How do I. so well. Um, no, that blue can't be in the middle. I've got to uh, I've got to cut the blue off on their own corner. Get the red in their own little zone. But then the yellows are not okay. So they've got to sort of um maybe I'm doing this a little bit backwards. Maybe if I just sort of Nah, I've got to get back there. Oh, for that brief moment, uh, I was truly flying. I was, I was free. <laughs> I was a bird. And then the Fire Nation came. I just don't really have enough room to to separate things here. It's just a little bit squidgy. Hmm. I'm just, I know I'm just sort of doing the same thing over and over again. So what I'm thinking is, um, so these blue ones, I can sort of cut them off like that, I guess. And then um, I've got to get those red ones. There we go. We got there. What does this do? Gives us the ability to open this door. So, I think that this puzzle is not actually meant to be solved from here. I think it is meant to be... I can't actually start it from there. So, ignore me. <laughs> um... Although, actually, maybe even if I can't solve it from here, maybe that does still give me my solution. So I want to go across, I want to get those four in the corner on their own, and that four top row, they're their own thing as well. I don't think these colours are real. Yeah. Um, there was a door like that in the town that we did yesterday, uh, and I think I'm looking at the same thing again. Yeah. So I want to carve those guys off. Uh... Oh, how am I going to do that? Up, down, and go around. Okay. Up, down, go around. No, because then they're all... Um, that's not going to work because... Well, oh, come on. That's a bit harsh, isn't it? All right. So it makes sense to get these red ones in a corner of their own. Black ones in a corner of their own. Maybe I've got to go up like that and then 
blue, white. How do I, um, I feel like I'm sort of going, need to cut a square at the bottom left off. Yeah, I feel like I've got to cut that square off, but then, um, actually I can just come here and do it because I know what the different colours really are. See, if I do that sort of thing, um, then the green and the blue-black things are in together. So how do I... Is that... No, because I've got to... This is really uh, challenging. Um, but let's look at what we know. Okay, let's hold on for a second. So I know that that has to be a thing. I know that has to be a thing. I know that has to be there. And then... Um, and I know that one of those has to be there. But I also know that one of these have to be there. Uh, actually does that have to be there or can I no but I feel like I do like that better yeah the design of this game is incredible but like that definitely has to be there because it has to be between the the green and the red that line has to be there this line has to be there, that has to be there. That's what I know. So I can't go past there because then I can't get that line. So I can do that first. That's fine. That's a goofy thing because then I've got three of them in the same area. No, I shouldn't have. I know that wasn't it. <laughs> Come on game, just let me, uh, let me experiment. I can't go up, so I've got to, it's either got to be that first, or it's got to be that first. I'm thinking that, maybe that, why, <laughs> come on. Is this a really easy one? Are you guys just sitting here looking at this being like, oh yeah, like, it's obviously this. Come on, Mitchell. Get your act together. Uh, wonder if that corner... No, I don't think that's significant. Um, I don't believe that for a second, Grand Elf. Okay, let's let's pair this back for a second. Um, the difficulty I'm having is splitting this area up into four different areas. So I've got two areas, I've got three areas. That's four areas, right? Um, like obviously they're not related to the colors right now, um, but that's the sort of thing that I can do. Um, so I think that what I might actually want is for, um, for these sort of blue and black things, I think that they are, are going to essentially, I think that that's going to be an area, basically that whole thing. Um, and I just have to figure out how to... Because as soon as I do that, there's sort of like inside and outside things, you know, like if I lace it like that, I've kind of got three outside areas and one big inside area. Um, because it has to... Sorry, Scapuro, I did read uh, what you said, and I'm very appreciative of that. Thank you. 
Um, it's actually it's actually really difficult sometimes to keep talking while I'm focused on the puzzle. Um, but then other times it does sort of help to, to talk it through. So it's, uh, yeah, sometimes it helps and then sometimes I, I, sometimes it just really, this is looking surprisingly positive, actually. That looks, that looks nice. But I've still got to go across there. And that's the, the trouble I'm having. It's just so uh, squished in. Um, the other thought I had is that I can, you know, there's no reason why this can't kind of, just because things are the same color doesn't mean they have to be in the same area. It just means they can't be in the same area as something else. Um, so like if I need to cut things up, I can. I just don't really see how that would be beneficial, but it's an option. Flipping heck. So that's got to be a thing. So something like that must be how it ends. Either that way or um, coming down here and carving off that corner. Uh, so the yellow, the yellow corner is like my lowest priority. Like, however that ends up is just going to be what I'm left with. So maybe that also means, so that is also going to be towards the end, that one there. So I don't have to worry about it right now. It's this and that, that are the two tricky bits. So this, that, the green is next. And then finding some way to separate that, but I can't. I'm going to double check the colors through the thing because if I no, yeah, that I've definitely got the colors right unless I have to look through this. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> The hardest bit about this game is figuring out what the puzzle is. I, I've said it before and I'll say it again. It's devilishly tricky like that. Um, it's just a real bastard. <laughs> um, yeah, that looks like there's too many different colors. I think that this might be it. Um, so sort of take that out and then I've forgotten even what the other things were. Oh, but that works. So cool. That's funky. Oh, I thought I was looking through a purple colored thing, but I'm in a purple colored light, I guess. I don't really know what's happening. It doesn't look, so these are different colors. Okay, so we're gonna have to like turn on the lights. Sorry, that's just fascinating to watch the colors change. That was really cool. Uh, I can't look down very far though, which is kind of frustrating. Um, then for this, I'm going to have to close it again, aren't I? I like there's like the flowers on the side that are also changing color is uh, such a clever game. Here we go. I, I'm really enjoying this area actually. That's terrifying, but um, this is nice. Man, this is, this is trippy. Up or down. Let's go up first. This has been a horrific mistake. Um, let's go down. Or no, yeah, I can't go up any further. But oh, it's cool. Um, <laughs> you know, my instinct just then, the way I, 
But when I turned to the left, my instinct was to look for an ammo box under the staircase, like in Fortnite. Uh, <laughs> that's where I'm at. Let's keep looking, looking, looking. Why do I feel like this is not what it looks like? Oh no. This will take us up. I assume the different light in here will change this puzzle. Yeah. So solving this puzzle, um, this one puzzle in different ways will take me in different places. That's cool. I like that. Uh, there we go. Oh, here we go. So there's like five levels, but one of those cables is broken. I really know what that means or what's going to... I don't know what that's going to result in. This is cool. So the next style of level was green light, wasn't it? Yeah, so because that cable's broken, I think I'm going to have to figure out what the solution would be based on the green light. Um, and I don't know what the answer is to that, actually. be that? Hey! <laughs> yeah, suck it. Green light. Here we go. Here we go. Up the way. Up the top. Well, not quite up the top. There's one more thing. Yeah, here we go. Then doing this one, we'll open up the laser box. Uh, uh, oh no. <laughs> I've gotten too overconfident. Uh, let's... There we go. Oops, so I am going all the way up. Ah, yes. Laser box, laser box. Guys, we crushed this. Oh, look at all the flowers out there. Man, what an angle. I can see they've had to like indent the mountain a bit to get the, uh, to give the laser room to go. Um, man, I just love this game. It's beautiful. I think I've still got one laser left. Um, so what I might do now, I think I've still got my boat parked down there. Yeah, because that's where I actually started this session. Um, I've really been on an adventure around the island tonight. Um, but we'll get this laser on, um, then I might go back to the town. Uh, and in the middle of the town, there's like a lake. Um, and the lake has like little lanterns on the lake uh, representing each of these laser boxes. Um, so if there's any that I haven't done, there'll be lights off in the lake. Um, and I think the lake is like a minute. I think the lake is in the shape of the island. I don't know that, but that's what I think I noticed earlier. Um, so I might be able to then figure out where this last laser box is. Oh, yeah. Um, and then we can go from there. Um, what was the... Uh, Nope, that's not the one I wanted. <laughs> I don't know how to get out of here now. Was it? Was it? Oh no, it was um that. That's the one I want. That'll take me out to next to the yeah here. Cool, fantastic. Oh, really fantastic, guys. All right, we've only got one uh, one laser box left. Okay. So I'll come back down to the boat and we'll ride that back into town. Or maybe even there's a map on the boat. Uh, that might give us an idea of what we haven't done yet. Um, 
so we've definitely done the mazes. That's the uh, that was the autumn kind of bit. We've definitely done that. We've definitely done that. Um, we've got a laser there from the town. We've got a laser from the monastery. We did the bird songs, and I hated every moment of it. So I guess that's the color thing we've just done. Um, I don't know what the last thing is. Um, I thought I'd done both of those. Maybe there's something more down at the starting area. Um, I'm really not sure. But yeah, hopefully if we look at that uh, lake in the town, I think that'll give us a bit more of an idea. And actually, maybe we should keep an eye out as we go for any more of those big yellow boxes. I had no idea what this whole area was. Like, I walked in there and there didn't seem to be anything that I could do. There's probably something that someone can do, but not me. <laughs> not me. Um, Alright, so... Ding, ding, ding. I love the ding, dings. Um, there's the monastery. We've done that. We've got the box from there. We've got the laser. Um, maybe there is something more over there. Oh, a little bug just landed on my phone. Okay. Oh, that's definitely an environmental puzzle, like starting there and going all the way around and finishing there. Alright, come on. Let me off the boat. Let me off the boat. I'm ready and rearing. Alright. So step one, we head to that lake. And, uh, and we'll look at the lanterns there. Once we know what those lanterns are, here we go. So here's the lake, here are the lanterns. Uh, where's the lantern that isn't lit up? Um, I don't see one that isn't lit up. Have we done all of the things? I'm not... Uh, no worries, Grandalf, I completely understand. But thanks so much for uh, for joining in tonight. I hope you've had a had a bit of fun. Uh, it's certainly um, I'm certainly enjoying this having uh, having other people to like talk to and stuff while solving these puzzles. It's great for me. So let's see, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Are there 11 lasers? I mean, I'm only thinking 11 because that's what someone in chat told me yesterday. Uh, we could have actually done everything. Let's come around here. Um, I'm not seeing any boxes in the lake that aren't lit up. You know what? Um, let's head for the mountain. Let's do it. I think I think we've done everything that there is to do out here. I think we've conquered this beautiful, uh, messed up island. Um, let's go for the mountain. How exciting! I uh, I did not think that we'd be uh, heading for a for the mountain tonight. I really really didn't. Um, there's, uh, so this is what the environmental challenges unlock. They kind of do things on these pillars, um, these black pillars. I don't know what happens if you unlock a whole pillar. Um, I've never done that. Hold on. Doesn't this go back into the birdsong forest? Oh no, it's going to bring me over here. Back to where I literally just was. Cool, 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 cool. Great. Fantastic. <laughs> um, all right. But there was a path that sort of came up from the swamp. And I guess that's where this will be taking me. Yeah, here we go. So I've been this far before. 
and this is where I turned around. So now I'm not turning around, we're going, we're doing it. We are heading up the mountain. Oh, there's a doorway. That's frighteningly clinical. I might keep going up the uh, just the general mountain path first and see what I find, see where I end up. Because I feel like the, the peak, the summit of the mountain is really the, the, the wow. Wow, that is, that is gorgeous. That is beautiful. The lasers look cool from up here. Oh, look, she's got a camera. Cheers. Oh, I see. Here's the 11th laser. Okay. Kind of weird uh, seeing all these, oh, he's, Looks kind of abusive. I don't really like that. Um, so I can see there's like one, one black thing there that I'm going to have to separate from the rest of the colors. Wait, why did that? When I started it, the ends disappear. Is it the same things that disappear? Um, I think I can do this one okay. Oh no, I can't actually. So it must be from this angle. No, I didn't like that, why not? I'll make sure, all right, that's separate, that's separate. So that black one definitely isn't with the white ones. Not sure what it wants. Okay. So that's there. Maybe I'll cut that more clearly. No? So if I start this. Okay. So what I'm seeing, right? What I'm seeing right now is as soon as I start this, um, these two exits disappear if I start from here. Um, so I think it's the same with each of the different starting things. It's the opposite exit uh, is the only one that still exists. Um, but, oh, there's another black bit there that I couldn't see before. Okay, that does change things. Um, I still think this was probably... Or might be the easiest angle to see the different things. So I'll get you straight away. Um, oh, yeah, that's going to be a bit rubbish trying to find an angle where I can um, where I can firstly get to the exit. I don't think that this is a serious contender. Um, yeah, no, not there. Could be here. Could be here. Uh, what well, can't quite sneak past his heel, but I still need to. Um, I need to go there to cut off that uh, black dot from the white dot. Uh, so if I go there, then the black and white are in the same thing. They don't like that. Um, Okay. Oh, here we go though. If I get that guy's... Can I go past the tape? No. That's a shame. Uh, maybe I've got to do that room that was underneath that I walked past. And maybe that will light up that other cable. Or maybe just doing this puzzle will light up that cable and the laser will come out or something. I don't really know. Um, what do we reckon, guys? Do we want to stay here and, and keep trying to do this one, or should we go back down? This is a little bit sneaky. I might actually be able to... No. Uh, yeah, do we want to stay here and do this one, or do we want to head back down into that uh, sneaky, like, room under... room under the mountain and try it? 
just going to keep trying this until anyone tells me otherwise. Oh, it's tough. Hmm. Can't quite. That's very kind, but honestly, I, I don't know. Um, I think it must be this one, actually, just because that is such a crowded area. Um, I don't seem to be able to... It's all so crowded. It's really difficult. Um, well, let's... Hold on, did I do this? I don't think I even noticed this before. Oh, it's, I see, it's the, um, it's this. Cool. Um, are there any other tablets around here that I've missed? There's a good chance that there are. <laughs> oh, what are these people arguing about? This guy's sad, he's crashed his lap. Grandolf, this is you. It's your laptop running out of batteries and you're being like, oh man. <laughs> um, can I walk into the path of this laser? Not intentionally. <sighs> you know what, what I might do, wait, is that? Yeah, this is the way I came down, uh, came up. I might head back into that room because I'm not actually sure that I'm ready to do that. Like, I'm not sure that I've done everything I need to to successfully complete that. Um, whereas I assume I don't have to do anything else to do this this room. Well, then maybe I do have to do the thing on top first. Who knows? Wow, I hate this already. <laughs> Why are the dots different colors? Uh, hold on, if I start here, will it be yellow? No. Okay, well, I'm just going to do the blue dots. Um, nope, didn't like that. What if I... Okay, well, I'll try to do all the dots then. Um, <clears throat> oh, it, I can't actually go any further. Why... What? There are certain, like, invisible wall sort of things here. Just sort of feeling out for any others. Um, I don't understand what this is. Like, why is this happening? Um, I guess I'm just going to have to find a way to make it work. Are they... Don't seem to be any problems going this way. I don't know if it doesn't, doesn't like that. You plugged your computer in, yeah. Here we go. Nope. Nope. Come on. Is there like a certain... Is there a length? Like a maximum length? Doesn't seem to be, because I can't go very far at all that way, but I can go quite far that way. I don't understand what it's asking of me right now. Can I get to that blue dot somehow? Whoops. <laughs> what is going on? Alright, I'll do that, I'll do that. Why won't it let me go? 
this is so much worse than I could have ever possibly imagined. Like, obviously that won't work. Why are there two starting places? Maybe, yeah, it doesn't look familiar. Is this, um, is it one of the first ones or something? Is it? Plus. Oh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how to interpret that, to be honest. Plus. Wait, is this like, um, is what I'm looking at here, um, is, th is this a reflection one? Yeah, it's a reflection, but I just can't see the reflection. That's dastardly. I like it. All right, well, I can, oh, why did I take that? That's silly. Um, well, I'm going to assume then that, whoops, I'm going to assume that the other side is like yellow and I just have to hit the blue dots. Um, so if I do that, then uh, the other side won't have hit that other yellow dot. No. Okay. This is quite devilish. All right. So there to there, I'm pretty happy with. <coughs> now to get that yellow dot there, I'm going to have to hit there, come back. Um, I'm going to have to keep that white dot on its own. Oops. Will that do it? No. No, no, no. That, that white and the black will still be together. Um, unless I... Yoink. No, that's a terrible idea. <laughs> um, all right. So I definitely want to get to there. I want to come up. I want to come around. <clears throat> I can't hit that. So what if instead of going straight there, I just went up and like that. That looks right. Hey, here we go. Here we go. All right, this looks like less than I was expecting. This is going to be another one of those hexagon things. Yeah, I keep finding these hexagons. I don't know what they mean. Um, I feel like there might have been something at the start of the game where you use them, but I don't really know what it is, so... That was fun, uh, but not uh, not necessarily useful as such. Let's go. Let's go back up to the other puzzle. Um, here we go. <sighs> Somehow we need to <clears throat> separate these different colors. Wow, I didn't like how that sounded. Um, I don't think it can be there, but like... If I start from here, I don't seem to be able to... Well, the angle doesn't necessarily have to be... Um, yeah, look, this looks pretty good actually, if I... If I could just... <laughs> if... 
Actually, is that going to work? I think that might work. Hey! Hey! hey. Oh, bollocks. It only opened a little bit. Do I have to do it with all of them? Oh. <laughs> is that possible? I mean, I guess it must be if it's asking me to, but... That one is really hard because it's so blocked from so many angles by all these cables and cords and things. So it's got to be like... All well, that let me go down. No, I can't get down. That's a real challenge to just just separate that black one from that white one. Um, how do I do that? Can I sneak around there? No. Um, all right, let's see. really tough. There we go, that looks better, that looks better. Um, there we go, I think that's it. <sighs> Alright, okay, here we go. This, uh, this last one over here. Is, is, it, is that it? Oh no, because those two are still um, joined. So I can do that and get those and then that no. Eek. different angle I guess to, um, to separate those guys from one another so doing it previously it was much easier because I had an endpoint over here so I just had to pass through there once but now I've got to go through there twice um, unless I can get around the back here so I can sort of um, If I do that and maybe from here, uh, um, if I could just get no. there we go, and then if I can just squeeze that around. I just need to get back into the middle there. I don't think I can... I don't think I can get around there. But do I need to, actually? Or can I just do that? Come on, not quite far enough. 
come out. I'm like leaning, trying to. <laughs> oh, that gets me there. That gets me there. There we go. All right. And then I guess this goes down uh, into the mountain challenge. Uh, this is this is it. This is the uh, as I understand, this is the end of like the main part of the game. Obviously, there are more puzzles and things to solve. Uh, but actually, I might disappoint. Oh, I don't know. Let's have a look. I'm thinking I might uh, call it an evening. It's just hit midnight here, um, and so this would be a nice point to start up again another time. But also. We've come so far, I don't want to give up. That's kind of unsettling. We'll have a look at what we've got in here, because I really don't know what to expect. Wow, this entire mountain is going to be like hollowed out with puzzles, isn't it? Um, all right, so this will uh, create a bridge. Um, what I kind of want is a one that goes along there, so I might um, be okay. And then I can just sort of like take that. Yeah, I can see eventually I'm going to want to end up on the other side. But I think that that will let me start the puzzles at least. slightly from the mouse okay uh, that's frustrating I guess but there are definitely worse puzzles that this game has thrown at me oh there's up the top there's like a sneaky hidden one okay yeah I get it I get it I was wrong stop rubbing it in game Is this really necessary? <laughs> oh, there was a thing that I had to hit there, apparently. <sighs> this is taking uh, quite a deal more uh, concentration than I would have expected. Um, oh. My path that I've made actually goes through uh, this in the mid Is that a puzzle I can actually solve? Yeah, it is. Cool. Uh, I wonder if I solve that, if this thing will disappear. Is that something I can... Yeah, it's sort of seems happy to let me do that. Uh, 
after that. I'm not going to bother doing it from here. It's just awful to try to watch. Uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm gonna back off out to here. Uh, I'm gonna come back up here. And you know what? Yeah. Let's call it a night. <laughs> let's come back to this fresh uh, another time. Um, uh, maybe tomorrow evening, or I know Jeremy and Scott were talking about doing some stuff, so we might be playing some uh, some For the King or some Civ or something. Um, thanks so much, guys, uh, especially uh, Grand Elf and Scapuro for being so active in the chat. I really appreciate it. Um, it goes a long way to making me feel like I'm not just talking by myself in a room <laughs> to try to do these puzzles going crazy. But yeah, thanks so much, guys. Um, if you haven't yet, feel free to follow, subscribe, and I'll uh, be doing a lot more of this. And hopefully next time um, we play The Witness, we will be finishing it. Uh, yeah, so thanks so much, and uh, have a good evening. <laughs>